Hey guys, Apple Maniac YT here. As you saw from the title and thumbnail of this video, uh, today I'm just going to be going over why Apple actually didn't support the iPhone 6, which is what I have in my hand right here, with iOS 13. They capped it at iOS 12.5.5, which is actually higher than the other devices supported. And there were just little security updates like iOS 10.3.4 for the iPhone 5 and 9.3.6 for the iPhone 4S and iPad 2. Those are just examples. Now, this iPhone 6, as you can tell, is running iOS 8.3. You can't tell that unless I open it up. There you go, 8.3, and it's a 16 gigabyte model. But like I said, this device supports up to pretty late versions of iOS 12. And this is the iPad Air 2. Uh, it's a pretty, it's, uh, no, it's modern, it's decent sized iPad, but it was released the same year and has the Apple A8X chip. Now this has the Apple A8 chip, A8, A8X. See the difference? Now the A8X is much more powerful and this device actually supported it until iOS 15. It's not getting iPadOS 16, unfortunately. But this device was capped at 12, this one was capped at 15 and here's why. Now the iPhone 6 comes with a pretty low amount of RAM if I'm being 100% honest. It really wasn't a lot. I believe it was like one and a half or two gigabytes. And then the iPad Air 2, I believe came with three or four gigabytes of RAM, maybe three and a half. It was a lot more, but I, I didn't really do any research before this video, unfortunately. Bruh. But uh, this iPad had much more RAM and a much more powerful CPU than this iPhone. Now that's what I think. It may be a different reason, but due to the actual specs of these devices, I think that's the truth. Now, another factor uh, that this device didn't support past iOS 12 is because um, it actually would have overheated because the, the newer the operating system, the more demanding and the more it actually gets, the hotter it actually gets. Now, for example, I, iPad OS 15 on this device runs extremely hot and wears down the battery super quick. That's why, that's why this one has remained on iOS 8 and it's much faster and does not get hot. Now this one on iPad OS 15 is super hot and even back on the iPad OS 13 it was it was it still ran pretty cool. So the new updates also tend to make the devices much hotter. So those are the real reasons that the iPhone 6 never got iOS 13. Hope you guys enjoyed this short little video. As I said earlier, this one's running iOS 8 and it's one of my prized possessions although it does need a new screen. But thank you guys for watching. Comment like and subscribe and as always, peace out guys.